Hi Leo, welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out what's the most likely outcome in your third party or love triangle situation. I have shuffled very thoroughly, um, set my intentions and laid the cards out for you to save time. To book a personal reading with me, all information is in the description box below. And today is the 18th of June, 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia is 8.28 p.m. All right, Leo, let's get your reading started. But let me set my timer first. Okay. So we've got the three of wands here. So this card suggests um, expansion, progress, and somebody might end up taking a proactive approach towards this connection. Okay. And possibly someone is going to try and lay a stronger foundation and to explore new opportunities um, together, to travel together. So number three, three of wands, of course, indicates third party situation, right? And when I say somebody, that means it could be you, your person, or the third party. And please bear in mind that roles can be reversed, okay? Um, it, it could be you, you could be the one putting two people in a third party situation or your person could be putting you in a third party situation you could be the original partner or you could be the third party okay please bear in mind it could go vice versa it could move around so um hmm. so we got the judgment right here so it feels like most likely outcome both of you will talk about how to expand this connection um a lot of dirty laundry will be aired okay someone is going to say something that has been hidden um hmm. and also i think this is going to help for you and your person to actually make really important decision hmm. so that both of you can start a new chapter so again three of wands judgment for once and more first there's something that is not strong in this connection that this is the reason this could be the reason why someone could be putting the other person in a third party situation okay see look at the two of cups here and it's your energy i mean this is your reading so the most likely outcome will be you coming together with your person and then, you know, again, hashing things out, airing all of the dirty laundry. And then the side, the side going to be deciding something where I feel is going to provide a sense of security in this connection. Okay. It feels like it's a, like rebuilding this foundation that is kind of shaky. So again, the three of wands here, both of you will talk about expanding this expanding this connection how to move forward how to take again proactive approach towards um this connection the goals of this connection okay because again it's not strong right for once in my first foundation is not strong so we got the page of pentacles in my first so i feel like yeah, there'll be a lot of talks, a lot of discussion about how to make things work between you and this person, okay? The outcome will be a discussion. So obviously, being in a third party situation, it means someone has to go, okay? Someone has to go. Someone is going to make a judgment call where with the Ten of Pentacles, uh, a judgment call, a very important decision where one can actually see being with this person long term and the ten of pentacles you know it indicates abundance wealth financial stability a harmonious connection family life um, an accomplishment and i feel like for some of you leo could be you or this person but the decision is going to be made based on how harmonious both of you could be like how harmonious this person can bring to my life can we accomplish accompl accomplish certain things that i want to accomplish uh in my life with this person the goals choosing the right path 
towards creating a secure and prosperous future. These pen pentacles indicates prosperity, right? So someone is going to make a decision based on how pros prosperous this connection could be, how both of you could make like such a good team in providing for each other, providing for your future family if you don't already have a family, uh, if you don't already have children with this person. So you could be involved with someone who is a Virgo Capricorn Taurus. Your person could be a Virgo Capricorn Taurus. But it also could be an indication if you're the one needing to choose between two people, choose the, the earth energy or someone who embodies more of a earthy energy, somebody reliable, someone who has money or has a job or someone who is responsible, nurturing. Okay. Or someone or your person may choose you because they see you as someone very nurturing. Um, somebody very committed right because the queen of pentacles you know is very practical very strong very independent very grounded resourceful and some of you may be if you possess these qualities if you're embodying the queen of pentacles your person and if you are the one being put in a third party situation feels like your person may choose you because of that okay So I've got the Ten of Cups here in reverse. The Ten of Cups in reverse can indicate challenges in emotional fulfillment, can indicate strained relationships. So the most likely outcome is also someone might let go of a connection that doesn't make them feel emotionally fulfilled. And that connection has been strained for a while already. And also it could indicate conflicts within family within you know a sense of dissatisfaction in that personal connection um, again when I say someone it could be you or the other person so someone is going to choose this connection this ten of pentacles instead of the ten of cups in reverse because you know already there has been some dissatisfaction in a connection in one of the connections and someone is going to choose with the ten of pentacles here connection that's much more fulfilling, much more stable. So you got the strength here. The strength card represents inner strength, courage, resilience. So there is going to be, again, a discussion in regards of how to overcome these obstacles. Could be you telling your person, your person telling you. So obstacles, challenges, all of that will be will over will be overcome, okay? And the two of cups here indicates deep connection, harmonious relationship. And I feel like potentially, you know, the most likely outcome could be someone is gonna choose to be in more of a meaningful and balanced union, okay? Someone who feels more like, this is my friend, this is my ride or die, this is a person that I'm gonna, you know, feel good being with. So one is, you know, again, ton of cups in reverse. Someone is gonna let go of this one connection that where communication with the page of pentacles in reverse don't even exist anymore or communication is not even good anymore. That's disharmony here and it's been really challenging with the ten of wands. The Ten of Wands indicates burden, right? Responsibilities, feeling overwhelmed, feeling like this is so hard to overcome, so hard to get to the to its destination, which is the Ten of Pentacles here. I feel like eventually, you know, most likely outcome would be someone choosing to persevere through any sorts of difficulties and you know it's it feels also this ten of wands like someone's gonna make a choice right and it's not gonna be an easy choice to let go of this other connection but still you know wanting to move forward with the other person because someone is gonna see that the ten of pentacles here that there is a better future with this other person okay 
And, you know, the outcome really depends on, you know, this judgment here, and this talk, and this decision. But potentially, it could, you know, you and your person could actually have this understanding and to move forward to creating like a stable, more secure future for the both of you. All right, Leo, this is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to my other channel. It's called Chelsea Blogs. It's my travel channel. And for those of you who like to be notified every time when I post your videos, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. And also, before I go live, um, I believe you're going to be notified. <laughs> I'm not sure, actually. But anyway, take care, Leo. Hope to see you back here again sooner than later. Bye.